If you're planning for the ride of your life, you got to start with the basics. Earlier today, hours before climbing in an F-16, Susan Dinkle was fitted for life support. They put her in a flight and G-suit. There we go. Equipped her with boots, helmet, oxygen mask, and all the amenities for a safe and comfortable flight. Be nice and comfy. The snaps first. I'm going to help you. I'm going to do it first, and then we'll practice it, okay? Next up, a detailed description of the ejection process and how to abandon plane in case of an emergency. And they don't just suit you up and load you on the plane. That's attractive. <laughs> The flight surgeon gave Susan a quick once over just to make sure that physically she was ready to fly. She passed, but her heart rate. It's probably beating a mile a minute. Yeah, I was going to say, you're, you're not nervous, are you? But who wouldn't be in Susan's situation? The final step, she got to know her pilot, Captain David Hayworth. As long as I can get you through this ride, they're going to they're promote me. Hayworth so took Susan here, through a few of the maneuvers she could expect nice later on in the day. First set we'll do is just a barrel roll where I just fly. 360 degrees, just a nice gentle roll all the way back around. We're going forward the whole time. That looks more than gentle. It's very gentle. And just in case you're wondering if she's in good hands, this is Hayworth's second season with the Thunderbirds, and he's logged more than 1,700 hours as an Air Force pilot. Uh, today we will go right up to the speed of sound and stop just a little bit short. Okay. And today, with extra special cargo in tow, he'll log another hour. Reporting from the Terre Haute International Airport, Liam McHugh, Action 10 News, WTHI.